The Raceland Chronicles. The Raceland Chronicles is a pair of novels, The Soulforge and Brothers in Arms, set in the Dragonlance campaign setting of the Dungeons and Dragons fantasy role playing game. The Soulforge. The Soulforge is a fantasy novel written by Margaret Ways and set in the Dragonlance campaign setting. The novel was first published in January 1998 and covers the early life of the character Raceland Manger. Margaret Ways has acknowledged Terry Phillips, the Soulforge gamebook for Advanced Dungeons and Dragons is the inspiration for the novel. Power metal band Blind Guardian wrote a song about the Soulforge, titled The Soulforged, on their album A Night at the Opera. Reviews Review by Wayne MacLaurin, 1998 in SF Sight, May 1998, 1998 Brothers in Arms Brothers in Arms is a Dragonlance book, the second of the Raceland Chronicles, written by Margaret Ways and Don Perrin. Brothers in Arms begins where the Soulforge left off, after Raceland Madger has passed the test of high sorcery. Raceland and Caramon Madger have decided to be hired as mercenaries, and are attempting to go to Langtry, the base of the army of Baron Ivor of Langtry. Antimodes goes with them part of the way. On the way, Raceland's horse throws him while fording a river, and Raceland catches pneumonia. He is taken to Haven, where he is healed by his friend, Lemuel. Antimodes leaves the brothers there. They winter in Haven, setting out in the spring towards Langtry. At the same time, Kishiaroth Matter, the twin's sister, is in sanction, trying to advance in the ranks of the Dragon Army. To prove her worth, Ariakas sends her on a special mission, convince the red dragon Emalatis to come to Ariakas in sanction, where he will receive orders from him. Kishiora succeeds, and the orders are to go to the city of Hope's End and find the hiding place of the gold and silver dragon eggs. Meanwhile, the twins have joined the army of the Baron Ivor, and are trained, Raceland as a war mage by Master Horkin, Caramon as a warrior, they also meet Scrounger, a half-kender and fellow recruit, and forge a friendship with him. Finally, they receive marching orders. The army has been hired by good King Wilhelm of Blodhelm to destroy the city of Hope's End whose citizens have rebelled against the king.